Hello YouTube! A few of you have noticed that I've got some artwork on my body, and I said that at 100 subscribers I would do a tattoo reveal. Well, we've passed 100 subscribers, so here is me doing a tattoo reveal. Now, I'm going to have to take my shirt off because they go a little bit far up here, and they go past this way. So I'm going to take my this dress shirt off. Uh, I won't take my t-shirt off because, well, you don't need to see that necessarily. Uh, but anyway, so here's my white t-shirt. Anyway, so throw that away. Let's get it started by this here. So we've got this here, white orchids. It's my wedding flowers. That was for my wife. Uh, she has the same thing, but over here on this side. Then I've got this one here, which is a city, as you can tell. But the branches are coming out of the building, and that's to... I really like living in the city, so that was life in the city type of thing. Some of my tattoos don't actually mean anything at all, right? Like, some of you might have meanings towards your tattoos, and that's great. Some of mine don't have any meaning at all. Um, there is a little red bus here. My dad works for the bus company, so I put that in there for him. And then I've got this thing here. It's three dice, and it says friends and family. And it's supposed to mean, don't gamble your friends and family away. It means like a nice thing. Then I've got, it comes up, I'm going to take my shirt up a little bit here, but you can see there, there's a headstock for a bass guitar, right? Four strings. It's a bass guitar, and there are flowers growing out of the bass guitar. And it culminates by having the rest of the bass right here on my chest over my heart. Uh, it's just... I really like playing the bass, and I've played it for years, so it's a thing for me. Then I've got this one. This is a full sleeve tattoo over here, and it means absolutely nothing. I just wanted a full sleeve tattoo. I've got two cardinals fighting up over here. I just thought that was cool, and I like cardinals. And then I've got some bugs and some flowers everywhere else. Like I've got a Oh, I don't know why I can't, uh, uh, oh my god, I can't think of the word here, but either way, I've got a thing here, a bug, and then I've got a beetle down here right around my wrist, you can, probably can't tell it very well, but there's the head, um, and then I've got a snail there. Again, they mean nothing. All I told to the tattoo artist was, give me two cardinals fighting, bugs and forest and whatever else, do your thing. I don't care what it looks like, do your thing, and he just went for it. So that's, that's that. And then I've got one here, which it looks like a Sarlacc pit. There's a reason for that. I like Star Wars, but it's really just kind of cool. Um, so it looks like a Sarlacc pit, but it's a Leviathan. You can see it's a big water beast. And he is, is the whale? The whale is right there. He's got a big whale in his tentacle, and he's going for lunch. Then I've got my really dumb one. I have to lift up my shirt a little bit here. It's a, it's a really dumb tattoo. So you can see there, and if I get a little bit closer, it's kind of faded. It's a nautical star, and it says, good times. It was my first one, and it's supposed to mean that I like good times. Because apparently that's not a thing that everyone likes. Very strange, right? First tattoo that happens. My last one, I have to drag the camera down a little bit, so bear with me here. Oh just because it's on my thigh. So let me do this here. Uh, still, that's not enough. You won't be able to see it. So let me do one of these. This is the last one. I raise the camera up. Oh, there's my dog. He thinks someone's here because I'm talking. All right, right there. So that is what you call a matryushka doll, and it has the proletariat there. Um, that's just my affinity for Russian culture and the left side of the political spectrum, if you will. Um, so that's that. That's all the ink that I've got. More is coming eventually, but that's what I've got so far. I really want to thank all of you for subscribing, all of you for sticking around and watching all of my videos. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. More is coming, and um, well, we'll see you soon. Mark, do you want to say hi? Come. There. And a hello from Marshall.